In this lesson, we'll discuss Azure Advisor. Azure Advisor is a best practice analyzer for Azure resources. We'll go to the Azure Advisor and take a look. We'll just click down here on the word Advisor, or you can actually search for Advisor. So I've done that, I might as well just click on the top one. The goal of Azure Advisor is to help us to ensure high availability. It also helps with performance cost and it helps us to secure our Azure resources. This is the Azure Advisor window and we'll have a look at the different options available in the Advisor. Here we can see that high availability, we have one recommendation, three recommendations in security, as well as the performance and cost all set. If you have any issues with performance or cost, Advisor will give you the according recommendations. Here you can also get tips and tricks for customizing our Azure resources. We can also download the recommendations as a PDF or as an Excel spreadsheet. So we can see this one recommendation and it's under high availability. So you can just click on it and here's the recommendation. Create an Azure service health alert. You can see the benefits and the impact. So we'll just click on it. And here you can see it's asking us to create an alert. So this way we can create a service health alert using the advisor. I'm not actually going to create an alert at the moment. So we'll just click out. And we noted that Azure also gives us alerts for security. So we'll click on the security tab and the three recommendations. Now we'll see what they are. One is secure transfer to storage accounts that should be enabled. This is actually highlighted as a high impact. Second one is access to app services should be restricted. This has medium. Last one is access to storage accounts with firewall. Likewise, we can get recommendations in the Azure Advisor. If you want to implement this one, we can go ahead and implement it. Just click here. From here, go to the respective storage accounts and we can enable the secure transfer. Likewise, we can enable the respective recommendations that are advised by Azure Advisor. You can also see the performance advices and we can get details from here. The same way you can click on costs and get the details. And if you want to get all the recommendations in a single window, click on all recommendations. And all the recommendations are stacked from high to medium to low. If you want to edit any configuration, then just click here. And you can see the subscriptions and we can also edit the rules. Here we can see that the CPU utilization is less than 5%. And from this rule, Azure Advisor analyzes the virtual machines and it'll provide any respective recommendations.
So in this lesson we discussed Azure Advisor, we'll move on to another topic in the next lesson.